Ladies and gentlemen of the Shred Gaming Tentacom video, let us discuss a recent issue that seems to have popped up with the Xbox One. There is reports that white goo is oozing from the console. I'll repeat that one more time in case you think I was kidding. Indeed, white goo is apparently oozing from the console. So, what exactly is the source of this? Well, actually, it comes from the Xbox One's official support forum. There's a couple of reports on this, and we're going to go into what they could possibly be in just a moment, the reasons behind them. But, effectively, um, the user said that I didn't just take a picture as soon as I saw the residue. I waited two weeks, then I came here to the forums to try and find out if I was only one with the problem. And then today, I posted the picture and contacted Microsoft like the person suggested. I took relatively, take relatively good care of my Xbox. I've only placed my controller or mic on top of my Xbox. I haven't spilt anything on it. And the oily stickiness that you see in the pictures is me trying to wipe it up earlier this week, hoping the problem went away. I've read a few of the comments on uh, other sites saying I'm a fake or a troll because they don't see any Xbox games on my recent games. Both AC4 and BF4 are on my Xbox One games list, and the only ones I have, I can assure you this is not fake. I don't have an actual camera, but I'll see what I can do about getting a better picture. There are a couple of very small images, incidentally. So, once again, the images that were supplied are very low resolution. And what could this white stuff be? Well, I'm going to leave the obvious jokes to you guys. I'm not going to touch that one with a 10-foot barge pole. And yes, you can make jokes of that as well. But, on a serious note, there's multiple things it could be. The first, let's just be honest, it could be his buddy Tom who came into his house. He didn't, you know, he didn't know that Tom did this, but he spilt a glass of milk on the system, right? And his friend's like, oh crap, quickly wipes it up, some of it sinks into the system, the system wasn't on at the time, and Tom's just like, you know what, I'm not going to tell this guy anything about that, I'll brave, blame it on his little brother. That's one example. I'm not saying that's what happened, I'm not saying that that's the cause, I'm not saying the, you know, I'm not trying to fob it off, that's one possibility, because we don't know. Another is that they are fake images. I, I don't know, you know, I, if the guy's genuine, no disrespect to him, I'm just saying it's a possibility. The third is that it is possibly a leaking capacitor or another chip inside the system. It's unlikely, and I don't really see how it's going to come on the system. Another option that some people are putting forward is that it's a thermal compound. Now, in case you're not familiar with thermal compounds, it's pretty simple. It's a kind of paste that goes between the heat sink and the chip. So let's say the CPU in this case, or the, the APU, which is the combination of the CPU, the GPU together, which is pretty much the AMD Jaguar. To get better thermals and to better conduct the heat from the chip, a small layer of paste is placed between the two. It's possible, I'm not saying it is, but it's possible that it's that. The only thing that concerns me about that possible scenario is that it seems a bit gooey, and I don't, I just, I don't really see how the li how the stuff would have come through the system. I don't, I don't, I just, I, I'm confused on how that would have happened. I'm not saying it's not, but once again, it's just a little bit puzzling on how that would have come about. So, it's possible, and it's probable, in my opinion, right now, that something has been spilled on the system, but, as I said, there are a couple of reports about this, just how true they are, what the cause is right now, the image is of really low resolution, that's not really an indication of a fake, that, you know, some people just don't have a good digital camera. For example, myself, until recently, until I started to really push the channel, I didn't have a camera at all. I'll just be blunt and honest, I just didn't. Um, just wasn't something I needed, and every time I was going to buy one, it just kept on getting put off, and, you know, I was using my cell phone for a camera, and some people have crappy cell phones, because they just don't really use them that much, so, you know, it could be that, I'm not saying that, you know, it's not a fake, I'm not saying it is a fake, it's just far too early to know, and hopefully we hear more about this as it develops, if it is a leaking capacitor, which is also possible, 
I don't know if you've ever experienced one on, say, a motherboard or another component that's blown. If not, just Google image them and you'll see what exactly what I mean. You'll understand that, yeah, looks pretty similar. But, once again, that is not saying that's what it is. If it's not, and it's something else, I'm not quite sure what it could be from inside the system. Whereas the Xbox One, as far as I'm aware, does not have any liquid cooling systems or whatever. So it could be from the thermals. Or it could just be someone spilt a glass of milk or something similar on the system and hasn't told them. It's just not known yet. There's just not enough information that I have. Hopefully a bit more of this pops up soon and we get a confirmation either way. Regardless, hopefully you've, hopefully you've enjoyed the video. I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye for now.